गुड मॉर्निंग गुड मॉर्निंग मैम गुड मॉर्निंग मैम गुड मॉर्निंग मॉर्निंग मैम मॉर्निंग मैम गुड मॉर्निंग मैम गुड मॉर्निंग मैम गुड मॉर्निंग मैम गुड गुड मॉर्निंग गुड मॉर्निंग मैम गुड मॉर्निंग गुड मॉर्निंग मैम गुड मॉर्निंग गुड मॉर्निंग गुड मॉर्निंग मैम मॉर्निंग मैम
fire accident and even it will cause death also. Okay, children. So we must okay. take this into when there is a gas leakage. Okay. Okay, ma'am. Yes. Next point. Never fail to turn off the gas stoves when not in use. So, when there is no use of uh, gas stoves, what you should do? You should off it. Okay, to prevent turn it off. Turn it off. We should not turn it on it. We should leave that like that. We should turn it off uh, when there is no use of stove. Okay, gas stove. To prevent leaks, stove installation should be inspected periodically. So we must always uh, keep checking. Okay, we must check it. If there is any leakage of gas, or we must. If you are able to understand me, just answer me if you are able to understand. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, to prevent leaks, yes, the installation should be inspected periodically. Okay. So we must always be checking. Okay. Yes, ma'am. We will move to the next point. Wait, someone is on top. Ma'am. So call my or disturb the class. Man, I cannot hear you. You mute the call. I am not able to hear the children who are talking or disturbing the class. Mute. We move to the next point, children. Clear you are able to understand what should we do when there is a leakage of gas at home. Yes, ma'am. Able to understand. Yes, ma'am. Understood. Yes, you understood? Yes, ma'am. Yes, yes. Suman's mute, ma'am. Suman, so, please mute your call. How many times to inform you? Okay, next point is do not wear nylon clothes while cooking in the kitchen. Because it will get... Yeah. 
you may have any signal issue, pa. Okay, so now we are going to see electric shocks. Many fires are the result of faulty or inadequate electric wiring. So what is inadequate? Not good enough electric wiring. Okay. So they would have not done the wiring good. So inadequate electric wiring. The wire may not be quali uh, uh, quality one. Okay. So you must have seen posters, iron, kettles, lamps, stoves, coolers and refrigerators being used in home. So we okay. use these things at home, isn't it? When we use toasters, we use irons, we use kettle to boil the water or tea. So we use lamps. We okay. use... Uh, uh, Sumant, uh, I'll share the picture. If you're not, if you're, if you're not able to see me, that's fine, okay? You're like, uh, Sumant, you're able to see the picture. Okay, so refrigerator, we use refrigerators, we use stoves, we use coolers, isn't it? So these, uh, these runs with the help of the electricity. Yes or no, children? These yes. things need electricity yes. to work. Yes, they need power to work. They need electricity to work. Okay, if they are not handled carefully or they are defective, so, if we are not handling it carefully or they are defective, what is defective? Not working properly. Defective means not working properly. Okay, so if the lamp stoves or refrigerator is not working properly, if we are not handling it properly, they may prove to be dangerous. So they are very dangerous to us, isn't it? Because they run in the electricity. They can give us severe electric shock or cause fire in the house. So, even I have got a shock, children. Very dangerous. Not as a defective thing. Not touch any plugs or any switches. Okay. You understand? It's not. It's not. To avoid such electric shocks, following measures should be taken. So, to avoid falls, we saw some measures. To avoid fire, we saw some. We saw some measures. So to now avoid the electric shock, Who's that? Tell me your name. Ma'am, your voice is breaking. Maybe signal your electricity. Now you are able to hear me, children. Hello. You are able to hear me? Yes, ma'am. Yes. To avoid such electric shocks, following measures should be taken. Now, first point is all electrical wiring should be installed and maintained by a qualified and licensed electrician. So, what they are saying is. Ma'am, your voice is breaking, ma'am. For everybody, it's like that, don't they, children? No, ma'am. No, ma'am. It's clear, ma'am. Ma'am, I can hear your voice, ma'am. Then maybe where you are, there may be the signal problem, ma'am. Emisha. Prapti, why are you drawing on the screen? Okay, so what I asked is all electrical wiring should be installed and maintained by a qualified and licensed electrician. So 
there is electrician who takes care of the electric uh, electrical wiring and everything uh, in houses in construction buildings everywhere okay so he is a licensed electrician so he is qualified in okay. so he, he will maintain and we should take the help of the electrician to do wiring okay the next point is never touch any electrical appliances if your hands are wet. So this is the main thing, children. If your hands are wet, you should not touch any electrical appliances. Not touch the toaster. You should not touch the lamp. You should not touch the kettles. If your hands are wet, okay. Yes, ma'am. Yes. Never unplug an appliance by pulling on the cord, or else you will break the connection with the plug. You should not pull any plugs, okay? Of the appliance. Be careful. Don't touch the electric switches or plugs. Understood, children? Yes, ma'am. Next is, do not go near electrical appliances while they are working. So, if their uh, washing machine is uh, running, you should not go near that. Okay. So, if it is working, if there is an air, cool, air cooler, so if it is running, you should not go near that when they are working. The switch should be turned off before touching them. So, before touching these appliances, you should off the switch. Okay. Understand, children? Yes, ma'am. So, do not touch the plug or switch with the wet hands. Are you able to see the picture? Yes, ma'am. Then, we do not plug anything because you are not kids. Next point is. Oh, An electric wire should not be overloaded by the addition of multiple outlet fixtures to sockets. If the wire is overloaded, the fuse will burn up. So, the fuse will burn up. Very good, Sanmai. 
Etanshi. Mummy. Mummy, we should not touch electric wires. We should not touch electric things and all, ma'am. We should not touch iron also, ma'am. When it's in the plug. Next two is ready. Ma'am, I, ma'am, I'm Pita Kiar, ma'am. Kiar, Pita Kiar. We should not touch phone, ma'am. We should not touch phone, ma'am. We should not touch phone while charging, ma'am. Okay. Next one, ready? Ma'am. Varsha, tell me, Varsha. Electric. We should not touch the mobile when our hand is wet. Yes, good, 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 very good. What, ma? Mobile status. Tell me your name and then you can answer. Tanshi, ma'am. Tanshi, ma'am. Tanshi, ma'am. Ma'am, we should not touch blades, knife and all also, ma'am. Yes. Tell me a point. 
We should not touch wires, ma'am. Yes, good. Next, anybody else is ready to answer me? Yes, ma'am. Yes, yes, Amisha. Yes, Varsha, tell me. Ma'am, we can't be seeing more mobiles or laptops, ma'am. Yes, good. Next, Amisha. Ma'am, I will say. Ma'am, we should not touch the hair coolers when with wet hands and when it's running now. Very good, very good, Amisha. Varun? Ma'am, we should not touch in the charger's mobile, ma'am. Yes, good. When the mobile is charging, we should not talk in the mobile or we should not touch. Okay. Yes, I hope you have understood what I explained. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma you are yes, not able to understand. Yes, Inform me. Okay, yes, I'll explain you all again also. Ma'am, I can see when you say. Hey, tell me, ma'am. Hmm. Ma'am, we should not touch iron with our wet hands also, ma'am. Very good, very good, Etanchi. Yes. So, everybody understood what I explained? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma yes, ma in the home, how should we save with the fire? How should we save with the electric shock? What are the measures we should take to avoid these things? Okay. So these are the things that I explained to you. Okay. Next, in the next class, we'll see the poisoning. Okay. In the next class, we'll see the poisoning and safety for small children and safety in school. So these are the things we'll learn in the next class. Okay, camera. Hi, ma'am. Hi, ma'am. Okay, Hope you're keep practicing Hi, the Bye, ma'am. Yes, yes. Keep practicing. Bye, ma'am. Okay, ma'am. Bye, and keep learning, okay? Okay, take care. Bye. Bye, ma'am. Bye, bye. Bye, ma'am. Yes, bye, bye ma'am. Bye, ma'am. Yeah, yeah. Bye, ma'am. Bye, ma'am.